All right, so today we're doing something a little different. We're gonna check out if you can vlog on the Canon EOS RP with just the camera and the kit lens. And to do this vlog, I have my daughter here who hates when the sun is in her eyes. Is the sun in your eyes? Okay. We're gonna go to the bagel store, as she likes to call it, get a bagel. We're gonna shoot this in 1080, 24 frames per second, and we're also gonna shoot it at 1080 and 60 frames per second so we can slow it down and see how the footage looks. I do have digital image stabilization on, so that'll be something to look for. But other than that, this is straight out of the box, just the kit if you were to get the bundle with a 24 to 105. And uh, let's see if you can vlog right out of the box with this kind of setup. Let's go. Emilia, where are we going? So the EOS RP has digital image stabilization and it has two phases. It has like regular and enhanced. So this is what the frame looks like when there's zero on and then I'm gonna show you how much it crops in for each one. So again, this is no image stabilization. And then this is with the uh, regular stabilization on. You can see there's a slight crop. And this is the crop with enhanced stabilization on. Now I'm gonna go chase my daughter a little bit to see how well this digital image stabilization works. So uh, let's get that done because you guys are really up in my face right now and I have to move way back if I were to wanted to get like a decent shot. So having enhanced image stabilization is not the way to do things if you're trying to vlog because this shot I think is a little too tight. All right, let's go chase her. Now I will tell you, even with the um, image stabilization on, the middle one, not the enhanced one, you can still get a pretty good frame if you wanted to vlog. Like right now I have it on and my arm is not that extended. I have it slightly bent and you can see I can fit my whole face in the frame. So I think you should leave the enhanced on if you're chasing and running around, but you can leave the regular on just to help you out as you vlog because I prefer not to use a gimbal. This camera is kind of bulky enough for vlogging. So I think with that little bit of image stabilization on the middle one, not the last one, the first one, I guess, uh, I think you'd be in good shape because this looks pretty good. Now, of course, the EOS RP does shoot at 60 frames per second in HD, 1080p. So we're gonna take, that is a lot of leaves. So we're gonna check it out, 60 frames per second, slow it down while she's on the swing so we can take a look at it. Uh, I also shot some other shots, as you saw, at 60 frames per second and slowed it down. But I just wanted to show you what it looked like with a little bit of action. So uh, let's get that done now.
So what are my overall thoughts with the EOS RP for vlogging with just the kit lens and the camera? I think it does a pretty good job. I mean, the 24 to 105 gives you plenty of room and plenty of range. The autofocus, as you can see, works great. The 60 frames per second slowed down looks really good. The image stabilization, I think, is fairly decent. So I don't think you need to gibble with this as long as uh, you give yourself enough room for that minor crop. And overall, the audio on this thing, I mean, I'm using just the um, Rode Video Micro and I think the audio sounds pretty decent. So. I think it's a good vlogging camera. The only thing that I don't like is that it's a little bulky, it's a little big, and um, also 4K at 30 is not great. I can't use 4K on this camera. It's only 1080, but honestly, if you're just starting off, if you want to start vlogging right away, and you get this kit for Christmas, or you decide just to buy this kit because it's on sale, I think you should be in good shape to shoot some stuff, or shoot yourself, or start your vlog, or continue doing your vlog. So that's the end of this video. If you like this video, please leave a like, also subscribe, and hit that bell notification icon so you don't miss any more videos. I try to make one at least once a week. I am Ken the Content Coach. Uh, go out and make something. Okay, let's go to the swings. Let's go to the swings. Let's go to the swings. We gotta go to the swings. We gotta go to the swings. So one thing I forgot to say is that I shot this whole thing in the standard color profile. The EOS RP doesn't have any C-Log or anything, so I can't really grade it or touch it much. But I think it looks pretty good. I think it has a really good color science and I look fine. My skin tone looks nice. So um, just keep that in mind. You don't get C-Log or anything with this camera, but the standard profile I think works fine.